And Argentina will continue. It's Leo Messi. Oh! That's why he's the best player in the world. And that's what the fans came to see tonight. And it's happened inside the opening two minutes. And it is classic Messi. Incredible. He only needs half a chance. And he punishes you. And Australia did what Graham Arnold told them not to do right from the kickoff. Doesn't need a second invitation, does he? And he's played the ball out wide here, and first time off Di Maria. Almost nipped him, but not quite. And Messi's managed to find the ball forward. Another chance here! And fired over the top by Alexis McAllister. Alarm bells ringing loud and clear again for the Socceroos. It's been a blistering start by the world champions. Oh, two line breaks and two efforts on goal. And Bacchus will drive it forward. Lift it over the top. For Molina. Oh, he's left it short. And Mitch Duke will nip in. Could be a chance here for Australia. And just to Di Maria. He's in position for the return. Messi. Side netting this time. Wow, what a play. Well, he's in the mood tonight. An early goal. Ring around. The Workers' Stadium. Rodrigo de Paul just knocked off balance. But uh, Argentina have retreated back in numbers. Can Atkinson get the cross in? Not quite. Messi. Doesn't mind operating in those tight spaces. He's well used to it. And draws the contact from Bacchus. Well, that night, Rodrigo de Paul off the chest. And it was just there waiting to be hit for McAllister, who's remained down with a bit of a knock. Well defended in the end by the Socceroos. For Magree. On the right is Lecky. And it's too high. Beautifully threaded through by... Riley McGree, and he's in position for the return. Back post cross, but there's nobody there. One and a half minutes into the game. And just Acuna. Building nicely here, the world champions. And just a little bit of a slip there. On the point of delivery. From Nicolas Gonzalez. One of many applies his trade in Spain with Atletico Madrid. That's a flag. His boss, it's a handy ball in, it's a really good save by Emi Martinez, which preserves Argentina's lead and denies Mitch Duke, who acknowledges the quality of the delivery. Well, and the save, lovely from Bacchus, just dropping the ball out to Boss, who skips in and finds Mitch Duke. It's really good from the first effort. Quite the same stakes tonight. Equally effective, and that pressure from Bacchus forces an error from Enzo Fernandez, and it will be an Australian inside the penalty box, of course. Headed firmly towards goal by Matt Leckie. And Argentina have got a player down, in fact, two. Maybe a bit of friendly fire inside. Their own penalty area from that corner, and the referee Ma Ning decides to stop play. That's a nice touch around the corner. Lecky's after it, but beaten to it, and he was a little bit late in the challenge there. And it's Christian Romero. He bore the full weight of his follow-through. Yeah, I didn't see a lot in this, to be honest. Is their way into the game, they're forcing errors, they're playing some great stuff. And again, and there's a bit of shirt holding there on Duke. Another little play here. Here's Jordan Boss, going to have a go with the right peg, which is not the stronger of the two. And he was also off balance as well. And it's those two again. And Atkinson sees it safely behind. Some of the uh, fans inside the stadium wanting a penalty.
going. Oh, it's a lovely little flick from McAllister. And there's a tangle on the edge of the box. It's a right idea. Picked up by Messi, who tries to thread it through. It's just a... And there is no flag here. And the chip goes over the top from Messi. Well, another impudent attempt to try and embarrass Australia. And it nearly paid off. Well, they're against the trouble, I think. Here goes Boss. Jordi Boss. Again, it's with the right peg. A little bit closer this time, but not good enough to trouble Emmy Martinez. And so far, just on that singular discussion, Argentina... Particular battle. Oh, that's not so good. Straight to the feet of Messi, and it required two minutes. And what a finish it was. Delighting the thousands who've paid big money to see him. And there we go, 35 years ago. That's Australia's last win against Argentina, that 4-1 win at... Uh, yeah, it was a shame for him. Just broke away because Gonzalez and Atkinson have had quite one challenge. Oh, and it's awkward for Ryan, really had to stretch there. And then makes the save at the near post as well to deny Alexis McAllister, or rather Angel de Maria, I should say. That's beautiful technique. For to take the corner. And Ryan... Well, again, I'm not 100% convinced yet. The measure of... Uh, into the channel. Building nicely here, and the header is on target. Rostich looking to angle that ball in. It wasn't a bad one, you know. It's a nicely worked corner, though, by Australia. And at the back post was Suta and also Bacchus. And Argentina were at panic stations there for a moment, and it's still alive for the Socceroos. Swings it across. Messi, little drop of the shoulder, goes down. And Marning right on the spot, says free kick. And it... Messi finds a way through. Courtesy of a touch off the wall. And fancy off Kai rolls. And, ahead of... and Argentina have to settle for a time. corner. Still plenty up for Argentina. It's two. Beautifully flighted delivery. And German Pazella was the Johnny on the spot to nod the ball home. Just his third goal for his country. And the world champions are too clear. Uh, little drop of the shoulder. Tees up Alvarez. Julian Alvarez, good save. Matty Ryan. To keep the margin at two. That's a great save. Had a good battle with uh, Nathaniel Atkinson. And Garnacho will race away down the left. International debut for him. That is sublime. Absolutely brilliant. Garnacho had no right to get through there, Messi. Uh, in pursuit. And Ryan Strain sees it safely away.